Historic sites in the Syrian city of Palmyra suffered greatly at the hands of ISIL. Since its recapture last month, people have been considering how to restore the UNESCO World Heritage Site. CCTV's Dan Whitehead reports from northern Italy, where artisans are working on a recreation of the triumphal arch from the Temple of Bell. Nestled in Italy's Carrara Mountains, historic ruins are coming back to life. 3D printers carve into Egyptian stone to recreate the 2,000-year-old triumphal arch, nearly destroyed by Islamic State in the Syrian city of Palmyra. Thousands of images of the ruins have been used to create 3D mapping, and alongside the latest technology, master craftsmen make the finishing touches. We sometimes think about if we were in the positions of the Syrian people and uh, we would like to have this, this kind of, of monuments and the relation that we have with our place. Once constructed, this arch will stand at nearly six metres tall. But the people behind this project believe that they can recreate more than just one ruin which has been destroyed by Islamic State. And there is plenty of reconstruction needed. Officials in Syria are assessing the damage. The project hopes it will lead to more ruins at the site being recreated. We know um, the, the, the Directorate General of Antiquities and Museums are leading the effort to survey the site currently. They're working very closely with UNESCO because of course the site is a World Heritage Site. And there are a range of other stakeholders who it's very important that we talk to, consult with, and they need to make the decisions about how the re reconstruction process progresses. Later this month, the arch will go on display in London's Trafalgar Square and New York's Times Square. The aim then is for it to travel to Syria itself. For the artists, the prospect of their work standing alongside the original relics is one to relish. Dan Whitehead, CCTV, in Carrara, Italy.